John Dixon Gibbs was a British engineer and financier who, together with Lucian Gawlard, is often credited as the co-inventor of the AC step-down transformer. The transformer was first demonstrated in 1883 at London's Royal Aquarium. At the time the term transformer had not yet been invented, so instead it was referred to as a secondary generator. Although he is usually credited equally with Gawlard, Gibbs' role in the invention appears to have been more that of a financial backer and businessman. Although the underlying physics of the transformer, mainly Faraday's law of induction, had been known since the 1830s, Transformers only became viable after the introduction of Gawlard and Gibbs's transformer design in 1883. The breakthrough was to build an iron transformer core which could act as a magnetic circuit. At the time, their invention was seen as overcomplicated since it contained a movable armature. It caught the attention of Sir Couts Lindsay, who used it to power the Grosvenor Gallery which was one of the first lighting systems in Britain powered by a central generating station. Information on an exhibition of Gibbs and Gawlard's Transformer in Turin, Italy in 1884 was published in 1885 and caught the attention of George Westinghouse. In the summer of 1885 Westinghouse bought the American rights for Gibbs and Gawlard's design and ordered that several transformers from Gibbs and Gawlard be purchased and shipped to his factory in Pittsburgh. Westinghouse then asked the engineer William Stanley, Jr., to design an electric lighting system using them. Stanley subsequently greatly improved on Gibbs and Gawlard's design and is often credited in the place. John Dixon Gibbs had his work patented under German patent No. 28947, a patent also recognized in Great Britain. The patent was disputed by Sebastian Ziani de Ferranti. Following patent litigation, Gibbs and Gaul had lost the patent. Gibbs appealed the suit, taking the case all the way to the House of Lords, where he again lost. He was financially ruined in the process.